Hello everybody and welcome back to the channel. We are playing Prison Architect. It's been a minute, but we're back at it and it just happens to be a uh, free update available now. It's called um, Free for Life and it is free. So if you got this game, get onto it. So here's a bit of the update. I'm actually going to read from the Steam page. So let's start with that. So, the Free for Life free DLC and Crowbar Hotel patch content. So we have Prisoner Agent, this is amazing. Long-term inmates will now be affected by the passage of time, becoming older, calmer, weaker, and finally dying from old age. That, oh my god, I can't wait to see that. Guard ranks, a number of your guards will be able to gain promotions, increasing both their stats and also their wages. When promoted all the way, to being a specialist officer, they will then also be trusted with a firearm. So that's amazing. So at the moment, they just have tasers, right? Now they're going to get guns as, as well. So that's brilliant. But that's also going to mean we're going to have to really look after our officers. Like not just have one officer in the canteen when there's like 50 guards. We, we don't want our uh, guards dying, right? We want them to rank up and stay in the, in the prison. So anyway, beautiful. Building guides, a few options have been added to make your design process a little easier. So they've added grid overlays uh, to each map cell, along with a new tooltip listing the dimensions when drawing your building, so that's great. Custom quick builds, using the clone tool you can now save sections of your prison for later use, that's excellent. There's an event log now, so uh, a log of events has been added to list any happenings within your prison, with each prisoner also having their own individual logs available from their menu. So that's pretty detailed now, that's great. Then we have a tidying of utilities, so now electrical, water and wiring all have their own menu, I'm guessing, so that's great. Uh, regime updates, regime options has been updated with some existing ones changed and new ones added to lower prisoner traffic in dangerous areas such as canteens and showers. Once prisoners have finished eating or showering, they can now continue to either free time or lockdown afterwards. So they're not just mulling around, wasting time, they just eat or shower and then they're off. That is, that is great. That's just like, flows so well, right? Scheduler update, this is what I'm looking forward to. The program scheduler has been updated to make the management of your programs easier and cleaner beautiful create prison menu updates the create prison menu has also been updated with settings now separated between those linked to the base game and dlc's beautiful and then lastly we just have policy menu the policy menu will also save any changes made upon being closed cool so if you forget to save it does it for you excellent so there we go feel free to read this i'll pop it over to the next one freeze the game look at it check out the steam page it's all there beautiful let's continue with our prison so here we go i cannot remember what we're doing we are building more cells we shifted the yard over here that's why some of these bench press are still being delivered we have a lot of people in solitary we also have to do a new section for these upgraded prisoners. So at the moment, I can't even remember how to play this game. So at the moment, we're dealing with uh, medium prisoners, right? But now we also have maximum prisoners because they've gone and murdered someone or done something horrible. So we need to do a separate section in the prison for these donkeys. So that's going to be fun. Uh, I don't know if we're going to get time. I realise visitation has no door for the prisoners. I say we just do a double door. That should be fine. So that might calm. And we need, we kind of need a door here to... Hmm, that's awkward. Because prisoners will come to this infirmary. We might have to change the door to here. Uh, yeah, we'll do that at a later time. Also, this common room, we need to move this. It needs to come over here. This is the expansion of uh, the canteen. 
this bit. And then we've got some other rooms here that I can't remember what we're doing. But anyway, we will figure it out. Let's do some walls. Right across here. And then we're pretty much just copying the footprint of the prison below us. Or the cells. That's great. So we really need this because we have 58 prisoners and we only have 20 cells. That means the rest of them are in the waiting room, whatever that's called. The waiting cell. Let's have a look because I know I'm wrong. The holding cell and there seems to be some death happening. God damn it. These people. So that's happening. Oh. We need to... No. I need this door to open. Do we need more staff? There we go. Let's leave this open for the moment. Lock open. Okay. Oh, there's something else happening. Oh, look at this donkey. Oh, uh, look at this donkey. Why is he even in there? Let me have a look at deployment. This is staff only. And I think this donkey tried to get in there too. Okay, so something happened there. Brilliant. Three deaths today. Oh, God. Oh, this dude has a knife! He's killing, he's killing our, our workers. That piece of crap. How the hell? He's still here. Right. Everyone go to yourselves. That piece of crap. So, we need more workers. Okay, staff... Workers, let's get 15. Uh, guards, let's get another 5. That looks good. Deployment. Okay, so here's the deployment scheduler. Let's see if I can remember how to use this. So, you have to... We need... I apologise. Policy, no. Uh... Regime. So you copy this. So all this. So zero is 12 a.m. So from 12 to 6. Is the first. Then we have. Uh, free time. Then we have eating. Which is now three. Then we have free. Uh, work time and free time. So that's going to be four. And what does that go to? That goes to uh, 7 p.m. So here. I hope that's right. 11, right? Yeah. And then 8. Oh no, 6 to 7 is free time, which was just number 2. I'll explain all this in just a sec. Then we have 18, which was 3. And then we have sleep, which is 1. Okay, so... All you're doing is, so sleep time is category one, okay? And it goes to six o'clock, but then it also is between 10 and 11, right? According to our regime. And then category two is free time, and free time also happens between six and seven. And then three is eating, eating also happens here. And then we have that. Right, so during the green, I know this is, this sounds difficult, but I'm pretty sure, I'm pretty sure this is how it works. And then two, we can, two is eating. No, two is free time. So we're going to leave everything there. Three is eating. So we want more people in the canteen. So we've got one person patrolling. And we want two in there. But we do not need this common room, person in the common room. So if we hit, go back to two, there's someone in the common room, right? 
If we go back to one, we can remove these two guards because they're not needed in the canteen, right? Because no one's in there. We can also remove the patrol in here between that time, right? Two will be, a, there will be a patrol, right? Through here, and we need to assign a guard. So, if we click back to one, yeah, the, the, we leave the patrol line. So, there we go. We leave the patrol line, we just remove the guard. So, between uh, sleepy time, there's no patrol here, and there's no guard deployed. During free time, there is a guard patrolling, because at free time, the dudes can come in the canteen. And then during the actual eat time, we're going to put a guard patrol in, and deployment, there's two people there. But during this one, there's none. Okay? So that's, rough, <laughs> that's roughly roughly what you do. So, so also during sleepy time, we can remove this guard from here. And we can remove the guard from the infirmary. But we're going to add a patrol. Now we have a patrol, we have two. Okay, so that's great. And then during free time, uh, during de eating time, we can remove one of the guards, I reckon. That will free it up. And then work time, free time, we'll put the guard back. Okay. Um, and then, yeah, during sleepy time, I know this looks confusing, but we do not need, we do not need a guard. Oh, no, we do need a guard. Because we have all these people here. All right, so, yeah, that's, that's, that's a rough guide of doing it. Uh, yeah, you, so, first of all, you just do the categories. One representing sleep, two representing free time. And then, again, free time happens between six and seven. You get the gist, right? And then you click on any part of the first category. And then you can add your deployment of a guard here and patrols. And then you click on two. And you can remove depending on where your prisoners are in the prison. Okay? All right. So cells, I think, I think they're being smashed out, right? Let's add some items. They're called objects, Dazza. All right, so we just need a standard bed. Now we're going to... The beds for like the higher tier prisoners are going to be horrible. And you know what? That's They deserve it because they're garbage. And then we need a toilet. We're going to need piping, one would assume. Our, our money is going down the gurgle up right we had we had sixty thousand. we don't have that i need to check if we have any uh that's all we had and then we need lighting we're gonna we're gonna give him some more stuff later on maybe some books yeah i did light in every cell keep him awake right and then Let's do one every second. Cool. That makes sense. All right, that looks good. So hopefully that happens. We can change this to cells. Now how many cells are we going to have? 33. We have 60 prisoners now. We must have got some more in. Look at this garbage. Why is there a pair of keys just sitting there? My God. All right, let's figure out. We've got some time. Let's figure out what we need to... This knife needs to be picked up, maybe, guys. Okay, yeah, this needs to be bigger. So let's, let's get foundation. This is going to be the new common room this bit here where do our visitors come through i have not done a corridor for our visitors right god damn dazza all right 
I think we know what we're doing now. Oh, God, really? Really? Five deaths? Who died? Oh, this dude. Bloody hell. I've got to get people out of here. I really do. Um, all right. Pipe in. Pipe in. Pipe in. Utilities. Oh, so there we go. Electrical. Water. Wiring. Um, I'm not massively knowledgeable with the wiring. I will admit. So if you guys have any tips for me, please let me know. So what we need to do, let's bring up our deployment, our scheduler. So during sleep time, we need another patrol through here. You can go out into this corridor actually. And then we're going to assign two guards. So that's during sleep time. During... So during shower time, I believe two was, deployment, we need two guards in here. Then three was eating. We don't need guards in there. Patrol, we don't need. Oh, let's just do, no, eating. That's all right. And then this is free time. We'll deploy a guard here. And then patrol will have one guard here. All right, that looks acceptable. All right, so we've got a dude. We're getting dudes in cells now. All right, doesn't matter that they don't have a toilet, apparently. The janitor. Congratulations on handing this calamity. Please accept the bonus of $10,000 to keep up the good work. God damn, thank you. I don't know what we fixed, but we did something. That's brilliant. All right, okay. Let's have... Uh, what, what are we? We're like 20 minutes into this video and I've just decided to look at what we need to do. Emergency protocols. Activate the stay indoors. Okay, so weather-wise, we can't do that yet. But we've done it once. Too many prisoners being held. That's fine. Uh, too many prisoners complain about lack of sleep. Okay, so we need to take on some more grants. All right. I have also... In uh, my private game, started doing this stuff. I was not aware that was a thing. So we're doing this. Prisoner reoffending rate? No, it's absolutely horrendous. What's this? Oh, we accepted it anyway. Wow. Hire a repairman to fix damaged walls and fences. We, we can do that, actually. We can do that. If we go to... It's not jobs. Let me just... Do some random clicking here. I'll come across it. I'm sure of it. Coverage. Hire the repairman to fix damaged walls and fences. I'm sure it's here somewhere. Prison restoration, right? Let's just turn this on. Repairman, there we go. Now we can just go to one. Uh, let's, let's hire two. Alright, that looks good. What's happening here? Uh, we have discovered a crooked guard working with a gang. I've marked them in the staff tab on your reports. Make sure you fire them. It was this dude. Look at him. Sack. Yeah, piece of garbage. Alright, so these repair people have come. Let's see if this does anything. Oh, we've got a little little bit of the, the Bible, right? The prison Bible. Excellent. What happened here? Install war lights. Okay, that's happening now. And this is still happening. So, object... Oh, I need to remove a wall, right? So we're going to demolish this wall because that's what we're doing. That's going to be a corridor. And then our workers can get there a bit more easier. We need to also lock, lock down this room. 
So let's get some doors happening. Rotate. I believe that should come down this way. Okay. That looks good. We need to finish off these showers. Wow, there's so much. I need to do another par parole room. This is a bit more tidier though, right? Uh, there we go. We did that. We hired the height, the repairman, and we did it. God damn, I'm amazing. Let's get another grant. Advanced staff training. We are doing... We are going to be doing the classroom soon. Advanced protection staff. Protection is paramount when dealing with organized gangs. Um, successfully trained 20 guards in disarmament certification. We need a different room for that, I believe. Prison maintenance. We can do this one. Um, all we need to do is unlock guard keeping through bureaucracy. Beautiful. What do you want? The roads are getting dangerous. Any vehicles passing the prison are going to have to travel much slower until conditions improve. Oh, okay. Oh, because it's sunny. Can we... Oh, for crying out loud. This heat has made the doors expand. We must get the workers to cool them down if we are to be able to use them. Okay, great. Can we... Can we do this? Um... There we go. It's gone to 66%. Right? Because it's a heat wave. We don't want our people outdoors. But we don't We don't need to do that. That's fine. We just wanted it to do that. And you can't press it again to make it 100. It has to be another event. Okay? Alright. How are we looking? These cells are almost done. Almost done. We've got some piping happening. Let's... Uh, Wow, we're having to do this ourselves. Oh, no, the guards are helping out a little bit. Yeah, there we go. They're building that. So we're going to have to remove this wall, make this canteen bigger. Uh, redo the patrol for that as well. Uh, this door needs to be cooled down. So, yeah, we gave these dudes a crappy bed. They deserve it. They're garbage. They went and did something horrible. This guy murdered someone. Wow. We're still making five grand a day. That is bloody beautiful. So we want to keep that up. So yeah, I think we make this. It's a toss up. This it's either this room or this room. One's going to be the laundry. One's going to be the shop. I think we make this a shop maybe, and this a laundry. Yeah, and then this is the common room, classroom. I was going to do the workshop, but maybe we do it the training room, maybe, or the or the chapel, you know. Maybe training can be off here, and then we're going to do security. Everything that doesn't need the prisoner to come in, it's going to go along here, because we want to keep the prisoner on the inside of of this hallway, right? That's the plan. Oh, let's remove this bang up. Jesus, I've done that for the whole episode, haven't I? The prisoners are pissed. They are. Look, they're already fighting. We might have to do a shakedown. I don't believe I've done that. Let's uh, turn this off. That can be shut. Yeah, everyone's drinking. Illegally drinking alcohol in my prison. How dare they? Got some room in solitary now. I'm sure there's going to be some new people... Visiting. I need to enclose this as well. So let's do... Alright, this is finished. So let's complete this. Concrete wall. Oh, someone's making a tunnel. Piece of garbage. Alright, we need to... Dismantle. Dismantle all of this. I'm sure there's an easier way to do this. I'm not aware of it. Please comment below if there is. Maybe holding shift down. I don't know. Dismantle all this. This is going in the new room. Uh, we're going to dismantle this door. And we're going to put the door on this side. And we're going to dismantle this door. 
Oh, it looks like a lot of people going into solitary. Having weapons, tools, um, digging holes. So we need to remove those tunnels. Where was it? Uh, it was just there. He just begun. And now he's in solitary. Yeah, I need to fix this. Foundation. This is... This is going to be another shower. One death today. What? Yeah, okay, that works. And then, yeah, that's, that's going to be a shower. Okay. Who died? Who died? Oh, he overdosed. Oh, okay. All right, so this has all been done. Let's get... This is probably going to be the last thing on the video for today. It must have been green. Do we do it? I think we do it in the hallway. Then we can do a door there and like confine them if they stuff around. And then items. So we need chairs for when they have their meetings. Yep. What else did we have here? We've got a pool table. I don't know why I'm so nice to these guys. Two phone booths. We've got a couch. Another couch. And we had two TVs. So we'll do one here. We can do one here. Why not? I believe that was all. But we can put some plants in here just to vibe it up. Make it cute. Alright. We've still got eighty thousand dollars my god and then what we need to do is demolish wall we need to add a wall here and here then this should be being dismantled right yes no it's been dumped no i want it dismantled so let's change the room. This is going to be, so this is a common room now. And then canteen. There we go. Excellent. So we can do some more, uh, some more chairs and tables. What are they called? Benches. Yep. So we can do one there, and one there, then we need a gap, and a gap, I, I think that's right, I always bugger this up, table, there, there, and there, and we can probably do some on the other side, but I think that's enough for the moment, let's just get some more lights happening, And then one more wall lamp here. All right, that looks even and pretty. Oh, we need lights for here as well. I don't know why it is. I'm just a big fan of these wall lights. There we go, that works. Cool, cool. Now we need to expand this this here. So if we go to deployment, this is free time. Our oh, free time is when they have the shower. Right. I need to deploy another guard here. And then this was eating. And then free time. We'll just have one guard there. Okay. So free time. We don't need guards there. We need them then. Patrolling. Let's expand this. Nope, nope, that's fine for the moment. And I want to add another guard. Now I go away. And then the same here. And then the same 
Just one guard. There we go. All right. What do you want? Gang members band together because they have similar interests. Sometimes they also dislike specific criminal offences. And they will try to target those individuals. Yes. What the hell happened here? When did this happen? Look at the... No, 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 no. Oh, you piece of crap. You piece of crap. Oh. Yeah, these orange dudes. I need to do something about that. What we're going to do as a short-term thing is turn this into orange. This corridor and these cells to orange. And then that garbage will be confined for the moment. It cries entrance. It does. Yes. Demolish wall. It's going to be here. Uh, yeah. All right, let's do... We have a bit of money. We're doing all of this. I've had enough of these garbage maximum dudes. I'm taking taking care of it. Right, so let's have a look at deployment from here. Yeah, we have no one in here. That's why that douche was allowed to get out. Deployment. And one in there. Patrols. Let's do a patrol here as well. Yeah, that looks good. And let's add a guard. And then... Jew in here. We're going to have a guard. Deployment. We're going to have someone there, someone there. And then free time... We'll just have someone here, someone here. We won't have the patrol. That's fine. All right, mate. Hopefully, I need I need tasers. So that's... Yeah, we need to finish up now. So uh, when we get back, we're going to finish doing some more cells for our medium security. We're going to do this small uh, restricted area for our high crime donkeys these orange dudes but we're going to do a whole new section for them over here once we establish ourselves a bit more then we're going to quickly do these three rooms because i and then i need a training room over here i need security to get armed guards as well okay so let's also quickly we needed to do groundskeeping to finish that grant off and let's research surveillance Armory, remote access, dogs, staff vetting. Let's do it all. God damn it. I spent a bit of money, but that's fine. So, yeah, we have... We've got a lot to sort out, but how... I mean, how aggressive are these prisoners now? They're just... Oh, I'm going to kill you. Oh, there's no guard around here? No patrol? I'm going to kill you as well. Oh, my God. It's great, but God damn, it's a little bit harder. And now we have a rat problem as well. My God. Oh, anyway. Happy Wednesday, guys. Enjoy the rest of your week. Uh, I will see you Friday for another live stream. We are playing uh, Sniper Elite 5. I'll see you later. Take care.